Killer K here. Welcome back to another episode of Kem's Killer Sources. Today we are going to be doing a review on the Australian Extreme Chili Condiments, one of Killer K's sponsors. I'm back after a long while of being sick. You know, life gets in the way sometimes, work. I've been crook for the last two weeks. But we're back here on YouTube for some awesome reviews. Uh, like I said, I've got a lot of reviews coming up. There's plenty of sauce reviews. The season's just starting to kick in. I've got all my chili plants in the greenhouse and whatnot. But today, like I said, we're going to be doing a review on the Australian Extreme Chili Condiments. Now this is chili pickled onions we're going to be doing today. So these are the Blurter Bombs from the Australian Extreme Chili Condiments. And like I said, focus, there we go. Rob makes all these from hand. These are just small batch blurter bombs, but as you can see, you can see all the chili flakes and whatnot in there. He makes all these by hand. It takes him, I believe he said, 18 hours to prepare. So you know they're gonna be made with love. And like I said, all the Australian Extreme Chili Condiments products I've tried so far have been nothing but amazing and Again, they're one of Killer K sponsors. So, without further ado, I'll read through the ingredients and we'll get to reviewing these chili pickled onions, hey? So these are the Australian Extreme Chili Condiments Bloater Bombs. Product of Australia, gluten-free and vegan-free. The ingredients, onion, white vinegar, pickling spice, sugar, salt, uh, chili, peppercorns and bay leaves. And what I love the most about these, you can actually see the chili and all the peppercorns floating in there. So I believe they're made with Carolina Reaper chilies, which is absolutely amazing. And then like Blurter Bombs, it's got a little bomb on there. But look how cool those labels are. I really love that logo. That's absolutely amazing. But anyway, I'll just give it a little shake up so we can get all the stuff from the bottom all up to the top and we'll open these blurter bombs so i'm i'm not i'm gonna be honest i've already gone through two jars of these so i know how good these guys are already and i've got another three put aside for me because i want more okay so i've got my fork here we've got our blurter bombs okay i might need to use my my Oh no, there we go. I was going to say I might need to use my shirt to actually open these things. Alright. So the smell coming off these is absolutely amazing. I don't want to like put it too close. Let, let, let me see if I can move the camera down. There we go. Look at that. They look absolutely amazing. Now I just move the camera up again. There we go. So like I said just gonna dig in and all right here's one of them here so guys just want to thank mr dunn again from the australian extreme chili condiments these are their blurter bombs cheers mm. i love pickled onions And I love chili, so this takes my two favourite things of all time and marries them. So, heat-wise on these things, again, Rob didn't make these things to kill somebody. So it's got that lingering heat in the back of the mouth, more so at the back of the tongue, and sort of a little bit at the throat. But again, the more you eat, like it warms up a little bit but he did not make these by all means to kill anyone he's made these to enjoy so you get the flavor of the chili and those little pickled onions i'm going to have one more but the 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 heat there's no real crazy heat so like even a non-chili head could really enjoy one of these i mean it is it's going to be quite warm for you but it's not going to be overpowering and just like kill you but the flavor, like, it's just like, 
you have no idea. You guys need to get these, get a hold of Rob and tell him Killer K sent you and get yourself some of these blurter bombs. Look at that. Beautiful. Perfectly marinated in those spices. And as you can see, they just go down like a treat. Hmm. They just break down in your mouth in layers. It's really unique. Like you get what through one layer of onion and then the next and then the next. And each layer has a little bit of an explosion of flavor and heat to it. But like I said guys, non chili heads or even new chili heads could even enjoy these because like I said there's no real crazy heat to them like on my heat scale I'm only going to give it a one non chili head you're probably looking at a four to five maybe six but again like I said there's it's not real crazy heat it's mainly being made so you can enjoy these but guys if you haven't tried any of the Australian extreme chili condiments products go check them out this is just one of very many and guys you need to get get in quick with these things because he only makes limited limited batches and he doesn't make these all the time so these are very special to him because it's a lot of hard work and labor and i take my hat off to mr rob dunn for everything you do for the chili community and guys go get yourself some blurter bombs like i said He's my sponsor, but also makes absolutely amazing, tasty products. Guys, if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. If you like it, hit that like button. And guys, till the next one, thank you very much for watching another episode of Chem's Killer Sources. And as always, stay killer.